Listen, I don't know who needs to hear this, but this life that we live in is not what it seems. It's not what it seems. So many of you have allowed yourself to be trapped in the nine to five workplace, knowing that you're miserable, feeling deep down in your heart like, is this all life, you know, God? Is this all God got for me? There's gotta be something more. There's gotta be something more. This lie that we've been trapped in. Society, the government has trained our minds and programmed us to think a certain kind of way, to suck us dry of any anointing or any kind of spirituality, to turn us away and distract us from any kind of relationship with God, using social media, using every kind of distraction, any manipulation they can to keep us under a spell and to keep us dry and to keep us spiritually unaware. Keeping us thinking that we're supposed to work a nine to five job and by the time we 50, 60 years old, we might be able to pay off our house. And by the time we 70 years old, we can retire, if that. And now, boom, you can't even enjoy your life. By the time you 40, 50 years old, you might be making 30, 40 dollars an hour. You can't even live off that nowadays. You're just supposed to be a slave to a nine to five job just to work, just so that you can live to pay your bills and feed yourself and then die. It's the biggest lie in the and scam of the enemy that, that has ever been told to us. Listen, you need to come out of that. How do you come out of that? You need to seek the Father's face. You're looking for fulfillment in every other place except Jesus Christ. He's the only one that can give that to you. Well, I don't know why I'm here. I don't know what my assignment is. Listen, you need to go through that uh, period of isolation. Everybody has to go through that period of isolation, meaning separate yourself from everything in the world, every distraction, everything that's coming onto you that's distracting you from him. Separate yourself from it. So it's just you and him. Just you and God, I promise you, if you truly do that, he will reveal to you who you are and why you were put on this earth, what your assignment is. And that's the only way to escape this matrix, this lie that we're living in. Everything is not what it seems. Amen. Listen, your job, your current circumstance, whatever you're going through right now, it's only temporary. Your job is not your destiny. That factory that you're working at that won't give you a pay raise, it is not your destiny. That office that you win, that you miserable in, it's not your destiny. You've been lied to. Amen. I want to pray for everybody right now. I pray that God give you this revelation. I pray that you come to know the Father, and I pray that he reveal to you who you are. I pray that everybody watching this right now come to know their assignment. I pray that everybody break free from those lies and limitations of the devil, of the government, of society, of the matrix. I pray that you break free. I pray that you walk in abundance. I pray that you walk in power, authority, and dominion. I pray that you walk in purpose with no hindrances or delays. I decree and declare victory. I decree and declare generational wealth and prosperity to fall upon you now. I decree and declare healing from any trauma, restoration, and transformation. You are a champion in Christ Jesus. You are the sons and daughters of a king. Ah, it's time to start walking like it, start talking like a baby. Amen. Come on, let's get it.